I'm so excited. First, look at my nails. Wow. I got my nails done and I just want really wanted to show it. <laughs> hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, welcome. My name is Camilla and today we are finally watching Scarface. I've been wanting to watch this for so long. If you're new here, hi, welcome. Let me introduce myself. My name is Camilla. I am 22. I created this reaction channel to connect with my father's favorite hobby when he Way. that is movies i've been doing this now for a little while i actually started this as a way to connect with his favorite movies and then it was just really wholesome because i started this during the pandemic and now we still do it and i love it so much so they were watching scarface i remember him watching this movie actually it is from 1983 i believe i'm just very excited to be watching this i am going to connect with this one in a more personal matter this is not requested this is not something that has been on Patreon polls. This is something that I have on my list from movies that he liked. I am so excited to watch this together with you. If you want to watch my full reaction, it's over on Patreon. All my social media, their links down below. No further ado, let's get on with Scarface. But the dregs of the jail? So what's dregs? Five thousand? Help! Oh, there he is. This is a banger. People have been saying that this is one of the classic mafia slash like gangster movies um another movie franchise that i have on my list is the godfather but right now we're working our way through the matrix we're still missing two movies there and then we can start on a new one so what do you call yourself eh? se llama? antonio montana there we go Where'd you learn to speak the English, Tony? Uh, in a school. And my father, he was uh, from the United States. He was a Yankee. Please, John. I learn. I watch the guys like uh, Humphrey Bogart. They inspire me. They, they teach me to talk. Yeah, you can learn from movies. That's what I do. I'm coming here, United States. So where's your old man now? He dead. He died. Aww. Somewhere. Mother? She dead too. Oh, bless. I was in the army. Any family in the States, Tony? Everybody stayed. You ever been in jail, Tony? Me? Jail? No way. Been in a mental hospital? Oh, yeah. And the boat coming over. <laughs> you like men, huh? You like to dress up like a woman? What? Is that a question you actually ask? This guy, am I kidding me? <laughs> it's actually the same as mine. Where'd you get the beauty scar, tough guy? Eating pussy? I'm not gonna get a scar like that eating pussy. You should see the other kid. You can't recognize him. And this? That's for my sweetheart. Sweetheart, my ass. We've been seeing more and more of these. Some kind of code these guys use in a can. Yeah. Why are you asking questions if you don't want the answer, dude? Do you want to be like a cheap? Like all those other people, man? Da, da. I don't know. <laughs> you own nothing? You got nothing? Do you want a Chivato on every corner, man, looking after you, watching everything you do, everything you say, man? Damn. He said it's rough. Send this bastard to Freedom Town. Let them take a look at him. You can send me anywhere. Here, there. It don't matter. There's nothing you can do to me. That Castro has not already done. Get him out that of here. Oh. That means he's really been through it. Tell him what you told me to tell him. I told him, told him you I was in sanitation. They didn't go for it. I told you to tell him who was in a sanitarium, not sanitation. No, I told you to say you, you had TB and you were in a sanitarium. <laughs> this ain't his first rodeo. Nope. When are you telling me that? You should have kept your mouth shut anyway. Oh. They'd have thought you was a horse and let you out. <laughs> We'd have thought he was a horse and let him out. You know what? I feel that moment when he's saying like he was learning English from watching movies and stuff because the last three years that I've been watching movies like once a week or twice a week for my channel I've been learning so much because English is my third language. I speak Norwegian as I am born and raised here in Norway. And then I speak Spanish because of my mom, which is Dominican. 
And then English I was learning because I was reading English books and then we learn it in school. But most of my English is self-taught and from games, books and movies. You know what? I love languages, but now I'm tired of learning them. It's so tough, man. <laughs> I got better things to do. No. <laughs> sure. What you got, man? We gonna be out of this place thirty days. Not only that, but we got a green card and a job in Miami. Ooh. No, man. Somebody else. You okay? No. You not okay? Guy named Revenga, man. Emilio Revenga. Oh, yo, man. I know that name. He's political. Well, he's coming in here today, man. Castro just sprung him. Oh boy. Well, Castro felt like he couldn't trust him anymore, you know, and threw him in jail. But while he was on top, he tortured a few guys to death. And one of the guy's brother is a rich guy in Miami now. He wants the favor he paid. Damn, Fidel Castro just put everyone in jail, man. Or even worse, on dangerous streets. But I think most people that worked with him as well could be dangerous in general. It'd be a pleasure. I kill a communist for fun. But for a green card, I'm gonna carve him up real nice. Boy, you, whoa. That is messed up. <laughs> oh, they're spraying them with water. <laughs> Run, man, they are going crazy. <laughs> Dude, chill out. This is his first day out here. Revenga! Oh, poor guy. He's saying, por favor. I do mean It's his first day out here. Oh. That's nice. Ay, Dios mío, mira eso. Look at that. That one right there in the pink. She's beautiful, man. Look at those titties. Look at that punk willow, man. What's he got that I don't have? <laughs> I mean, look at the way he dresses, man. Come on. That style. Flash. Pizzazz. Pizzazz? Lil Havana is not only a restaurant, they said they're, they're also a club. Waldo, good to see you, eh? Probably a casino in there, too. I got something for you. What do we got to do? We got a lot of both. Marry one, 25 times. You get 500 each. 500, that's great. Eh? You gotta be kidding. You guys are so good at this in the comments, so please let me know what is $500 in this time. Hey, into the pool. Yeah, look, okay. okay, okay. Hey, all right, big man. You want to make some big bucks? He wanted a thousand dollars. Dígame. Are you kidding me or what? They are not subtitling the Spanish. I just noticed. They say they got two keys for us for opening. I want you to go over there. And if it's what they say it is, you pay them and bring it back. You do that, you got five grand. That is a lot more than 500, my guy. Go pay it, bring it back, yeah. You know how to handle a machine gun? Yeah, man. We were in the army in Cuba. <gasps> That's no problem. That's no problem. If anything happens to that buy money over <laughs> my boss is gonna stick your heads up your asses faster than a rabbit gets. Oh my god. Uh, they hadn't subtitled it, but if you're wondering, Digame means come on, tell me. And then Pobrecito is like, you poor guy. What, what was this with the Colombians, man? Eh? What does it matter? He says Colombians and you make these eyes like, what? I don't like Colombians, okay? That is a personal thing. Washing yourself, man. Could you? I retire. Somebody I gotta know. look after my investment. Close the shop, man. Okay. You know what? This is just going to be straight up chaos. I'm so excited. Look at those tits, man. She begging for it. What? What? 
specimen. She's 103 years old. Not that one, man. That one, dummy. Which one? Which one? Your one, man. Come on. The ass. Move the car. She's 103 years old. Hola. Entra. Am I leaving the door open so as my brother knows everything is okay? Sure. No problem. Hello. This is Marta. Marta is scary. <laughs> in the car. No, not in the car. Man. No? How about you? Where do you have just stuff? Not far. Oh my god. That guy is such a flirt all the time. Where do you not stop telling it? You just fuck. She said, uh, don't move, douchebag, and now they're telling him to go to the bathroom. You going to give me the cash? Or do I kill your brother first? Hector? We have beef, Hector. Sticking your head up your ass. See if he fits. Yeah? Okay. You are very rude while having a gun to your face, man. Oh, I told you Marta was scary. She has a shotgun. Protect your boys. The color blue is very distracting. Watch what happened to your friend. You don't want this to happen to you. Let me know, Mario, okay? You said it doesn't have it. <laughs> oh my god. That'd be late, huh? You guys run! Don't walk! Run! You can die too, it makes no difference to me. Okay, Chicho. To go over there. It's over again. Oh, you're just walking with a machine gun out in the open and no one cared. Oh, he really doesn't care if he dies now. Bye, Marta. Oh, the poor wo woman. You okay? Yeah, man. Went in out. Oh, damn. Got that. Damn you. They left it out to his brother-in-law. He must have died, bled to death. He lost an arm and a leg to a chainsaw. That is the most messed up thing I have ever seen. You do that. You still got the money. Yeah, and I got the yayo. You got the yayo. Is yayo really what you call cocaine? I'm taking it to look past myself. Or is that just what they say over the phone so people don't track it? That's the guy in the white dress jacket or suit jacket, he seems so familiar. The white blazer. You understand what I mean, right? They all call me Frank. How are you? Manny Rivera. Down. I. He got one on the job. Going right through. You heard about that? Omar. He tells me great things about you guys. Yeah, he seems so familiar. I don't know where I have him from. Well, you don't have to mention that. That was fun. That was fun. All right. right. That was fun. <laughs> What? <laughs> hey, what do you want to drink? You are insane! I need a guy with steel in his balls, Tony. A guy like you. And I need him around me all the time, you. Then you can buy the here. You're gonna find. You stay loyal in this business. You're gonna move up. You're gonna move up fast. Hello. And then you're gonna find out your biggest problem is not bringing in the stuff. But what to do with all the guys? <laughs> she's coming. You're gonna jump on her when she's not looking. The best thing. <laughs> Whoa. Wanna go to a nice restaurant with me? You hungry? Go eat a horse. Okay, they're gonna cook you a horse. <laughs> 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 Alright, I'll eat it. Oh. She a pretty pretty girl. 
and the bodyguard is staring. I thought we go to the Babylon Club. Again. Oh, she's tired of it. That son of a bitch didn't get a base in all season. I should kill him. <laughs> Frank is insane. Another restaurant bar or restaurant club. <laughs> he keeps finding them, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> you know what a casa is? <laughs> no, Frank, you tell me. What do you say, casa? <laughs> it's a Yiddish word for pig. We don't fly straight no more. I love Tony's character. Oh, such a good character so far. The other guy's green. <laughs> Lesson number two don't get high on your own supply. Damn. $550 worth of bottles on it. What do you think of that? Where do I have this guy from? Amadeus! We have him from Amadeus, guys! Okay. <laughs> I was like, where have I seen him? Do something, something big next month. We are running a string of mules from Colombia. That sounds like fun to me, finally. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of him? I think he's a peasant. <laughs> but you get a guy like that on your side, it breaks his back for you. That is true. But especially Tony, because Tony came from nothing. At least he said that he was struggling. Oh God, I have enough friends. I don't need another one. What you talking crazy for? I'm a political refugee here, okay? Only you got a look in your eye like you haven't been in a year. Maybe she hasn't. Not yet, man. You gotta give me some time. Isn't she Frank's lady anyways? We're blind, desperate, starved and begging for it on a desert island. You'd be the last thing I'd ever... How do you know? I know. The eyes, Chico. They never lie. He's delusional. The booze and the concha tell him what to do. Just remember last year this time we were in a cage. Ooh, okay? I like to forget that. You guys have gotten so far. In a not legal way, but right now you're free. Chico. And everything in it. Oh you're so gonna get Manny killed, aren't you? Oh, I actually like Manny. He's a little bit crazy, but he's a romantic. <laughs> crazy romantic. By this time, I'd have my own boat, my own car, mm. my own golf course. You know what I want? A line of blue jeans, right? With my name written on the back of chick's asses. You're a simple guy. Look, you're missing all the sight. That's what you're doing. We're, we're missing the action. You want to have some ice cream with my friend of me? Get lost, Chris Paul. You can do it that way, I'm telling you. What if we that? <laughs> His reaction. That is disgusting. Watch. Ooh, look at that thing that looks like a lizard. <laughs> but the women in this country, when you do that, they know. They know what? They understand. They, they go crazy. They're on the way. Go ahead. You think you can do it with her? I think I can do it with her. You're not going to do it. Watch this. Come on. Okay. That's not gonna work. You wanna see something funny? Hey, take a look over there. You see that man there? Watch that guy. He's gonna stick his tongue out to that girl. Don't look at that. Hey, <gasps> yo! You see what happened to him? I told you that's not gonna work. Uh, Frank got held up at the golf course, so he told me to come pick you up. Uh, he said he'd meet us at the track later. In that thing? He must be kidding. Hey, he seems really cool. I wouldn't be caught dead in that thing. Okay, my bad. It looks like somebody's nightmare. You are very negative. How much? 43,000 fully equipped. That all? Put them this. Okay? And this one. And here. Can we afford it? I thought you were taking me to Frank. We got an hour. You hungry? No, but I'm bored. I understand that. Okay. Don't get confused, Tony. I don't fool around with the help. He just tried to take her. You wanna play that way with me? I play with Would you kiss me if I wear the hat? No. Okay. I thought we were going to the track. But now it's dark. Oh, we're doing something else. Is this where you live? Mama. Antonio. Long time. Your mom looks so young. Tony? Oh, hey, look at you. <laughs> look at that, you look like me. No? You know the last time I saw you, you was like that. You look like a little boy. <laughs> you look like a little boy. Uh, 
got sulfur fingers. Dang, it's no big deal. Oh, Tony. I haven't seen you in a long while. Always. <laughs> Always. It's beautiful, Tony. The mom doesn't look very pleased. All that's over. It's starting today. My kid sister don't have to work in no beauty parlor. And mama, she don't have to sew in no factory. What if she wants to work in the beauty parlor? It's a thousand dollars. Who did you kill for this, Antonio? Oh, you did. Banks? Or is it still bodegas, you and the others? No, things are different. I'm an organizer now, and I get a lot of political contributions. Sure you do. Mm-hmm. You can never lie to your mama. It's Cubans like you who are giving a bad name to our people. People who come here and work hard and make a good name for themselves. What are you saying? That's your son! Son! I wish I had one. It is true. No, that's not the way I am, Antonio! That is not the way I raised Gina to be! I don't want you in this house anymore! I don't want you around Gina! Get out! No, Gina hasn't seen her brother in five years. But I do understand the mom. Take this lousy money with you. It stinks. Tom, why do you have to spoil it for everybody, huh? Trying to keep you safe. Tony is in the dirt. It's true. Mama doesn't know what, but she knows he is. What am I gonna tell her? You take that. You don't tell her anything. You don't tell her I give it to you, but give us some from time to time. He's doing this for his family and his living. You gotta get some fun out of life. <laughs> You're gonna beat yourself to death at 19. Don't let her see it. I'll talk to her, okay? I'll talk to you. Okay. Are you going to comment about her now, saying she's hot? She's beautiful. Hmm. Hey! Stay away from her, do you? Okay. Also, we'll be cutting out the Colombians. That means we have to go to war with them. Cut out the Colombians. We take risks on both sides. You know, we're losing one out of every nine lows. That's not duck work. Why did that guy look like a more spicy version of Jack Nicholson? <laughs> what do you suggest that is reasonable? <laughs> oh. If he wants to make a deal, it's up to him, not you. We're gonna do this one deal, that's it. You need to open your eyes and keep your mouth shut. That's it, let it go at that. They don't trust them. So where were we? Panama. You're looking for a partner, right? Or something like that. They said, let me do the talking. I got no right. Nobody got no right to negotiate Omar, for Frank why don't Lopez. You let man finish, okay? Let him propose a proposition, hey. and then we can talk more. He just said, let me do the talking. Oh. Well, I don't think it's something I want to do on an overseas phone. As soon as I get back <clears throat> to Miami, I don't talk to Frank personally. My associates here can escort you to my chopper. My chopper can take you to Santa Cruz. I don't trust it. Because that guy is sus. Not him. The other guy. I was holding the phone earlier. He's sus. He's a very sus. I think so. I have to hand it to you, Mr. Sosa. You got everything a man could want. I like you, Tony. There is no lying in you. Unfortunately, I do not feel the same about the rest of your organization. I'm talking about Omar Suarez. Uh-oh. The guy that was here. I told you he was sus! I told you he was sus! So how do I know you're not a Chivato too, Tony? Let's get this straight now. All I have in this world is my balls and my word. That piece of shit up there, I never like him. I hear he's not. Do you want to go on with me? To say it. If you don't, then you make a move. He's direct. Mr. Sosa might like that. You can't lose money. No way. We make 75 million on this deal, Frank. You short a couple of mil, I go on the street for you. I make a couple of moves, a mil here, a mil there. You got it. Oh, why did you say that to Frank? He's gonna get you killed now. Look, Frank, time is gone. We gotta expand the whole operation. Distribution. We gotta set our own mark and enforce it. I'm scared of Frank. I don't know if he's enjoying this or not. Like your friend, Sosa. Let me tell you something about that grease pot. He is a snake. That's what he is. Ooh, he doesn't like Sosa. Omar was a stoolie because Sosa said so. You bought that line. He did. Maybe you and Sosa know something I don't know. You call me a liar. You stole your deal with Sosa. I am the boss. He's gonna say it again. Oh, never mind. <laughs> the guys who last in this business, the guys who fly straight, low key, quiet. The guys who want it all. Chicas, jumpe, flash. They don't make it. They don't last. Yeah, it's so better to be quiet and lay low. <gasps> Tony 
is so disrespectful. Hi there. You just missed Frank. He's here for you. Too bad. Well, I didn't come to see Frank. He came to see you. So why don't we have a couple of drinks? Act normal. And just take it easy. You know? Come on, I like scotch. Sure, why not? I heard you and Frank aren't working together anymore. Oh. That's right. They actually called it quits. Quits. I want to talk to you. Come on, sit down. I'm not going to bite you. Okay, here's a story. I come from the garden. I know that. All right. With the right woman, they no stop on me. I like you. I like you the first time. I lay eyes on you. I say, she's a tiger. Oh, the tiger reference. Belong to me. Yeah, but she's kind of in a relationship, I think. I want you to marry me. Marriage. I want you to be the mother of my children. She's going to laugh. Frank is not gonna last, okay? He finished. I want you to really think about it. I go now. Take care. Is she actually considering it? But then think about it. She doesn't really seem happy in the relationship either. I just hope that she doesn't like. Montana, how are you? Hello, I don't know what it's called, but I just hope that she's still loyal enough to like either break up with him first. Because what is gonna happen? If she goes behind Frank's back. Tony's gonna die. Oh, he's gonna go crazy now. Oh, he's going to beat up the guy. Keep your eye on him. My office. Good. So the word on the... Is that his office? <laughs> we tell you who's moving against you. And we shake down who you want shaking down. We got eight killers with badges working for me, and when they hit, it hurts. Same thing works the other way. How do I know you're the last cop I'm gonna have to grease? What about Fort Lauderdale? Metro, DEA. Yeah, how is he gonna know that? My guys got families. They're legitimate cops. I don't wanna see them embarrassed. They're embarrassed, they're gonna suffer. And if they suffer, they're gonna make you suffer. Comprendi? Comprendi? Huh? Huh? Oh, there she is. You know, you are really nuts. You know that, Tommy? Oh, what's about you? What's your pleasure? I'm good. That's what I'm doing. Oh, you go do it somewhere else. Well, get lost. Right. I'm giving you orders, blow. Orders? You giving me orders? Oh no. It's boss. You got me? Oh, you're gonna get yourself killed. Even your friend saw it. I tell you what, man. You know a little trip we were playing to New York? Oh, he's gonna go crazy now. Oh, he's gonna go crazy! No! <laughs> <laughs> Yet, yet, they weren't doing anything yet. No, I want to see it now. Shut up, get the fuck out of here. Come on. I'll do what I want to do. I'll see whoever I want to see. And if I want to fuck Tony, then I'll fuck him. You've seen your sister twice, man. For five years. And now you're being a total. What? You want something? Huh? Ugh. He's your brother. He loves you. That's why he did it. All right? He cares about you. He still treats me like I'm a baby. I'm 20 years old now. He's, I'm not anybody's oh, baby. You're so grown up. Put yourself in his place. That's also true. So, of course, he doesn't want you out there mixing with those people, growing up to be like him. Exactly. Against guys like that asshole that you were dancing with tonight. Hey, I like, like Fernando. He's a fun guy and he's nice. And he knows how to treat a woman. What if he's treating several women? How do you know that? Yeah, and he was going to do it in the bathroom stall. Talk about being a gentleman. Oh. Oh, it's not the real one. You gotta look around and go out with, with somebody who's, who's got something on the ball, who's going somewhere in life. Like who? Like me. Like, for instance, someone who's got a real... <laughs> oh. <laughs> or, a, or a doctor. Uh, what about a you? A lawyer. Oh, don't do that. What are you talking about? Why don't you take me out? Throw code. I see the way you look at me, Manolo. What do you think? I'm blind? I see. Bro code! What? Gina, you don't do that. Yeah. Your brother's friends, really? So and that's where it ends. So what? I can ruin a friendship, honey. I'm afraid of anybody, okay? That's not the point here. Oh, he's gonna do it. Oh, help! <laughs> Are they going for it anyways? Oh, they're going for him. Oh, 
Talk about being lucky. That is so scary. Imagine you're going at a bar or a club and there there's just a shootout. That must be so scary. <laughs> we thought he got away. What time? Three o'clock, sure. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, it's because that he thinks that or knows that those people were Frank's people. Uh oh. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Fix the umpire? They wanna spoil my eight hundred dollar suit. There always is, Tony. I bet it was the Diaz brothers. They got beef going back to the sun rate. Oh maybe Frank and Mel are the rats. There's so much chaos. No, I think care this myself. I, I tell her you're not here, okay? No, it's all right. Oh, Frank. It's all right. We're going to be home in an hour. Don't worry. Hey, Frank, you're a piece of shit. What are you talking about? Come on, you listen to me, huh? Do you know what a hustle is, Frank? <gasps> the door flies straight. Neither do you, Frank. Damn. I made what I could on the site, but I never turned you, Frank. Never. Who are you? A man ain't got his word. It's a cockroach. Man, I'm do something with you. What is he gonna do? This is your case. You can you give me a second chance. I give you I give you ten million dollars You almost got him killed, bro. You will never see me again, Tony. Please, I don't want to die. I never did nothing to nobody. I never... No, no, no. You never did nothing to no, nobody. Not directly. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm saying too. Oh Christ, thank you. Get off. Manolo, shoot that piece of chip. No, 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 no. Well, he said he wasn't going to kill him. He just got someone else to do it. And that's how that went. <laughs> are we gonna talk to Mel now? Oh, we so are! Oh, no! Don't go too far, Tony. I ain't not, Mel. You are. Ah! Ah! Oh, that scared me. Maybe you can handle yourself one of them first-class tickets to the resurrection. So long, Mel. Have a good trip. <laughs> Oh wow. You want a job, buddy? Sure, Tony. <laughs> hey man, you got a job. Huh? Hey Tony. Thanks. He's like, I'm so deep in this job now. Tony. Yeah, now you can be together. Good, what's happened? He solved the problem. In his office. Wow, I really need to get some silk sheets. That looked so nice. So far, I don't recognize any of the scenes. So maybe the hello uh, to my little friend is the wrong movie because right now it seems like we're getting close to an ending. Maybe not. I spoke too soon. <laughs> he bought her a salon? Oh! Wow. He sold his whole life. Oh, Tony, are you going to let that happen? Oh, I think they would be so cute. He got a tiger. Every time I see people do it with their nose, it reminds me of when we were watching Pulp Fiction and uh, she like started bleeding everywhere. Oh, I feel like that's gonna happen in this movie too now. You sweep the house this month, guys? Yeah, I told you about it. $5,000? Look at that, the cable truck. Since when does it take three days to wake a cable? What do you think it's cops? It'll be the Diaz brothers. Come to get me. Uh oh. Then we're gonna blow that truck back to Colombia. He really hates the Colombians. It makes me sleep good at night, that's what counts, okay? You worry about it. I am worried about it. I'm telling you, you're getting sloppy. Ooh. Charging me 10 points on my money. But they're getting away with it. What a cool bathtub. They've been around a thousand years, okay? They got all the angles. Oh, and look at that closet. In recent months, Just go for it. Just wanted to ask a question. How? He tried to have a conversation with you, Tony. He didn't even want to listen. They're the ones that want to make coke illegal. 
so that they can make the money and then they get the votes. They're fighting the bad guys. They're the bad guys. Tony is always so mad. Money, 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 money. That's all I ever hear in this house. Money, look at this pelican fly. Come on, pelican. It's not a pelican. You know what you're becoming, Tony? You're an immigrant spick millionaire who can't stop talking about how he's getting. I work hard for this. I want you to know that. I understand that you're sad. It's too bad. Somebody should have given it to you. You would have been a nicer person. Yeah, you seem like a total douche. Sorry. You got nothing to do with your life. Why don't you get a job or something? Don't toot your horn, honey. You're not that good. Oh, no. Frank was better, huh? Asshole. Yeah. Where'd you go? Come here! Help! Help me! He's so angry. I was only kidding! I guess sometimes my life is not all it's cracked up to be, you know? I got a date. With your sister. Women stay out of it. It's my deal. I set it up. You're not a negotiator. That's your problem. You're not gonna trust me with that kind of thing. Who the fuck are you gonna trust? You know what? You should listen to your wife, man. She's right. You are an asshole, man. <laughs> Come here. Give me a kiss. Come here. Come here. Oh my god. Montana Realty Company. It's 284. 284, 600. Say, uh, how come you don't know Benny Alvarez? Me and Benny. Oh, I thought he was going towards a bent and someone was spying on them. You ask. Oof. We've been here a while. Get him up! Get your hands up! Put your hands against the walls, turn around. You're not kidding. Put him up against the wall. You're under arrest for violation of the Rico statue. How do I know you guys are cops? Oh, that's pretty good, man. <laughs> That's really good. Where did you get that? I want to call my lawyer. Yeah, a lot of good he's going to do you, Montana. You see that eye there on the clock? Say hi, honey. Oh, someone was spying on them. <gasps> oh my god! I was like, I was thinking it was going to be a vent and someone looking at them and it was just a clock. I don't, no, it is a freaking surveillance camera in it. He's such a good lawyer that by tomorrow morning, you're going to be working in Alaska. Hey, what the f you talking? The jail's like tells you. Get him here, what? You hi or what? I'll delay the trial. What a foul language. Alex. Oh, yeah, I'm so glad you could come on such short notice. I really appreciate it. Oh, he's back. I want you to meet some of my friends. Is it somebody we know? This is Pedro Quinn, chairman of the... Okay, maybe not. Sit here, Tony. Gentlemen, I would like to discuss something that is of interest to all of us here. You have a problem, Tony. We already know that. I think together we can solve all our problems. Oh, this guy. Let me show you a few of the other characters that are involved in this uh, tragic comedy. My organization just recently traced a large purchase by this man. Oh. Cucumbre just a couple of months ago bought a $12 million villa on Lake Lucerne in Switzerland. Damn. This man here, Alejandro Sosa, a very <gasps> interesting character, is not your ordinary drug dealer. Oh boy. He's going on French, British, Italian, Japanese television. People everywhere are starting to listen. Oh, they want Tony to go for him. Uh oh. You remember Alberto, don't you? Yeah, Alberto is a sus guy. Alberto is an expert in the disposal business. Like he hung Omar from a helicopter. No problem. Oh, he's out of it. 250, you got a bag for a belly, you got tits, you need a bra, they got hair on them. <laughs> what? Don't eat nothing, sleeps all day with them black shades on. I can't even have a kid with her, man. Her womb is so polluted. I can't even have a little baby with her. How dare you talk to me like that? There we go. You don't even know how to be a husband. That is true. Okay. I have Nick the pig as a friend. What kind of life is that? That is so true. I'm leaving you. Honestly, as she should. You don't have the guts to be what you want to be. Tony, is that really who you want to be? Oh, great. You need people like me so you can point your fingers and say, that's the bad guy. So, what'll I make you? Good? 
sober. Me, I always tell the truth, even when I lie. Oh boy. So say good night to the bad guy. Come on. Go. Bye bye. Don't ruin everyone's day. Go out. You're ruining everyone's evening. Oh boy. That is so creepy. <laughs> the way he's staring at him. I heard you the first time. You don't have to keep telling me. One time. That's all you gotta tell me. <laughs> How is that even okay that's probably not healthy at all but how is he still alive like did you see that you told me she took the kiss in the other car she did boss she did every day <laughs> i don't know what's going on my dad was at the tip of solo sing bue sing hijo oh no okay. oh no but he has a wife and children do a little kiss in a car Okay, I see him, all right? I see him. Oh my lord, he's stressing me out. May you feel good to kill a mother and a kiss, huh? May you feel big. You think I killed two kids and a woman? You die! <gasps> no, but you wouldn't listen. Why, well, you stupid? Look at you now. Well, that is a solution, not the best solution to the problem, but a solution. Okay, just tell her, tell her, I call her, I call her tonight, okay? And, and listen to me. Uh, what about Elvin? She call? I don't think she's gonna call you. Okay, okay, listen to me. If she call you, you uh, just tell her I love her. Yeah, we saw how much love you had in you at the restaurant. Oh, uh, just chaos. You hear from Manny? No, Tony. Your mama called again, uh, she gotta see you. Uh, and Sosa has been ringing every half hour on the 11 line, Tony. He sounds pissed. I'll be caught. No. Hey. I want him here now. Okay. okay. Manny's probably with your sister. Because Manny's gone. Gina's gone. Yeah. Okay. I'm going over. I'll be over to see. Okay. Chaos. Chaos happened. Now our friend has got security up the ass. And the heat is going to come down hard on my partners and me. You take it easy it. when you talk to me. Do you want to go to war? Come on. Do you want to go to war? We'll take you to war. Okay? Tony. He's not there anymore. Yeah? Hey! He's not there. Come on. Yeah, calmate. Oof. Don't you see what you do to her, don't you? I don't give her that kind of money, mama. Oh, yes, you did. One time, a thousand dollars you gave her. Okay. What's the guy with her? Maybe it's Fernando. I know if I go in there, she'd kill me. She's like you. Okay, where's the place? Cit Citrus Drive. 409. 409. I think. That's on you, man! Why do you have to destroy everything that comes your way? He's probably there. Okay, listen, so I'll try again. He's going to die over this coke thing because he's going to end up bleeding from his nose and just overdosing. Yeah, that's how it goes. That's what I said. Oh my god! He's going to beat up Manny. <laughs> or shoot him. Yeah, Antonio, you really screw up everything you touch or come close to. Wow. Am I supposed to like him? Because I'm so sorry, guys. I don't like him. Look at this. Manny has been by his side this entire time. I understand that it is... We got married just yesterday. We were gonna surprise you. They got married! Like, Manny has been there this entire time. He's been taking care and standing by his side. I understand it's his little sister, but do you really need to pull out a gun every time that someone is, like, doing something you dislike? Sorry, if Antonio isn't gone by the end of this movie, I'm losing it. <laughs> he killed our Manny. Manny's been there this entire time and been so nice. Oh, he's backing him up, you know? Even though you guys are doing illegal stuff. No! No! That's a tiny place! Let's go! No! 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 Oh, 
cold they're coming to get you, Tony. We put some pills into her. She's gonna be all right, Tony. She's cooling down, right, Ernie? Oh, she's gonna be fine. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so fed up. Oh, I'm so fed up. Oh, Antonio. What are you going to tell your mom, huh? Because you can't connect with your feelings. Look, there they are. Oh boy. Yes, Tony is all done. <gasps> is she going to take her revenge? She has a gun in her hand. Is this what you want, Tony? That's your sister, bro. Why is she naked? I am all yours now, Tony. You see? Yours now. Gina. Oh, oh come on, Tony. <laughs> bye, bye, Gina. Gina. Okay. Oh, look at your face. It's all done. Think about the mom. Oh, poor mama. Oh, my lord. Straight up chaos. Chaos. Okay. Do you want to play rough? Okay. No. Say hello to my little friend. So that's where it's from! It is from here! Okay. Damn, that was very late in the movie. Yeah. They're coming. They're coming. Come on! Come on! Come to me! Okay. The guy in the back is just taking his sweet time. <laughs> He took the bullet. Oh, Tony. What a mess. But Manny and Gina, did they really have to ruin their happiness because you're insane in the head? Oh. And poor mama. I feel so sorry for her. We finally watched his car face. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, I actually love this. This was so much fun. It was amazing. But the thing was, I went from liking Tony, cheering a little bit for Tony, even though him being a bad guy, because I was like, oh shit, he really just wants to do what's best for his family. But after a while, I was like, no way. I, I can't feel any like sympathy for this guy because he shot his best friend. He was so rude to his wife. He got his sister killed, and it's just so weird, and uh, I mean, love this movie, understand why it's a classic, I understand why my father loved this one, because he did enjoy these types of movies so much, like Mafia, um, Gangster, anything like that, he really liked it, especially like Tarantino movies, and we tried Pulp Fiction, not my cup of tea, but I'm not done with Tarantino. I'm not done with him. It just wasn't... Some scenes just was too much for me. <laughs> and that's fine too. This one, loved it. So much fun to watch. It was devastating sometimes. So brutal, so gruesome. It was incredibly made. Understand why it's a classic. So ahead of its time. All in all, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching it together with me. If you want to, totally subscribe. It would highly, highly, highly help out the channel. If you want to watch my full reaction, it's over on my Patreon. All my social medias, they're linked down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I can't wait to see you in my next video very, very soon. Bye, everyone! Put your hand